is kind of the symbol for our campus. That is the center of our campus. You know, it's not a particular symbol for any holiday or religion. It just kind of represents us. So to kick off you know, our holiday season, we like the one. actually following a tradition that stems from 1991 when this was uh, Long Island University Southampton College. It's a wonderful community tradition of lighting our windmill on the shortest day of the year. We invite everyone to come uh, appreciate the, the beauty of our campus and then we'll all repair to um, Chancellor's Hall for activities for the children and cider and cocoa and windmill cookies. Sleigh bells ring, I listen in the lane, snow is glistening, a beautiful sight, we're happy tonight, walking in a winter wonderland. I think I haven't missed a one since 1991, so I'm, uh, I'm glad to be here and I'm really, really pleased that Stony Brook is keeping alive this tradition. I heard it was like a big thing in Southampton too, like it's been going on for years, so my mom was like, are you going to be going? And you know, it's a big Southampton town thing, and I was like, all right, show up. It's better than I thought it was going to be. Everyone's just having a great time. I'm with East End Disabilities, uh, which is a group home for people with handicap issues, so we decided to come out and see the lighting. As we came together and we're trying to figure out events to do, when the tree lighting was mentioned, or the windmill lighting actually was mentioned, uh, everyone seemed that excited and wanted to come out. This windmill has been one of the traditions that really links Southampton College together with uh, SUNY Stony Brook Southampton. Uh, so it is a link to our past, it is a light, a beacon for our future. This is my winter song to you.